So Karen, I have to start, what happened on 17, what was your take and also the discussions on 18 afterwards? Well, you know, um, Alison Lee had a birdie putt and she putted it and she missed it. And the, and the putt went by and she just went to pick it up and no one gave her the, the putt coming back. And I was standing quite far away, so I didn't know how long, you know, the putt coming back was. So I had to go ask, you know, Suzanne and Charlie if they had, you know, if they had planned to have given that putt, but they, they didn't. So, but, you know, clearly Alison Lee made a mistake. You know, she, it's very clear that you have to, a putt has to be conceded. Was there any discussion on 18 afterwards about maybe sharing the point or anything else? There was a long, long talks between everybody there. Well, you do, we, we just wanted to clarify what happened because, like I said, we were standing far away, and you know, even even Alison Lee's uh, partner, Brittany Linsicum, had told her, "Don't pick it up," but she said it too late. So we, we just we're getting all the facts. Moving on, here we are now. What a performance from your team this week to be standing here as the final match is teed off, teeing off now with such a good lead. Uh, you know, it's amazing. My team's just been fantastic. I'm having so much fun with them and my vice captains and everyone. We're just, you know, having a good time. But both teams are playing such fantastic golf. I mean, that's what the Salon Cup's all about. It's a great golf that's going on and players on both teams just playing their hearts out. And just lastly, what about your pairings, your, pairings, your selections for this afternoon? What are your thoughts behind that? You know, we're just, uh, I have 12 strong players and... Uh, I put most of them out where they wanted to go, but also, you know, there's a little strategy of what we think is going to work the best.